What happened? All the way down? Oh no. <laughs> well, that's not the right place for it to land. I'll go get it. Oh. What are you doing? I'm getting throwing a chalk line so I can start putting my sip sheet in the roof. You know, obviously we're not professionals, so it's not perfectly squared. Um, I try starting over here on this corner, you know, just using the corner as a guide, but then as I got more towards the middle, it kind of started lying. And it was uh, kind of going a little bit towards the inside. So the fascia, at the end of the day, once you got to the bottom end, the whole fascia was kind of exposed. So yeah, it's not square, it's not perfect, but you know, so I'm throwing in a, a line right now. I think the longest part of the roof is over there, and the shortest is over here, so I'm gonna start on that end. Uh, I just pretty much marked the four feet up to that point, four feet up to here. And then just cut off the excess. I'm still figuring it out. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I'll help you figure it out.
product of our hard work and it's really fulfilling. But oh my gosh, it is really hot. We're hitting 100 degrees today. And they are, the men are up there on those container roofs on the south side where the sun hits all day long. And it is hot. I'm in the shade and I'm under my hat. They have hats too, but oh my gosh, it's still unbearable. Unbearable. But. Pretty girl. Oh yes. Oh yes, yes. You love watermelon. Watermelon is super delicious. And super nutritious. It's 23.32s. It's pretty thick. It's a little bit less than three quarter OSB uh, for the, the the loft roof slash floor because our deck is going to be up there. And if we have to add something thicker afterwards, then we'll just add something on top of this. But this on its own and its tongue and groove is really sturdy. So, they're installing it already. Mm -hmm. 